Hello and welcome to another video. My name is Nazem Skandekar and today we're going to update a Windows Phone 8.1 app to a Windows 10 Universal app. Let's get started. I have my Windows Phone here. It's 3.23 p.m. Tuesday, September 13th. And let's log in. Now I'm back. I just realized that I had the MS Power User app. Very nice app. Open. I'm just going to go back to my start screen here. And then I'm going to uh, show you the app that I want wish to update. I'm going to go to my torrent app. I'm going to this is a, the app's called the Tor Torex. Um, uh, it's it's an app that lets you download torrents. Now, the da uh, clients for torrent or downloading torrents themselves or torrents themselves are not illegal. The type of torrents you download determines the legality. So if you tr download something that's legal via torrents, that's great. But if you download something that's illegal, for example, copyrighted or against the law, and if you use it by torrent, it's illegal. So it's not the it's not the torrent itself that's illegal; it's the type of files you download. So, and that that, that applies to not just torrents; that also applies to web browsers. If you use the web browser to download an illegal file, that's illegal. It doesn't it doesn't make the web browser itself legal. So uh, here's the torrent file. It's called Torx Lite. There's a paid version as well. But this is the Windows Phone 8.1 app. It's a WinRT app made using Windows Runtime, introduced in Windows 8, but it's designed for Windows Phone 8.1. And once it loads, as you could see this has the Windows Phone 8.1 uh, UI. So you could like swipe back and forth, inactive, all downloading torrents, seeding, completed. You see these uh, buttons. So there you go, like add torrent from URL. You could add the again the the um, the type of uh, the dialog box you saw is a Windows Phone dialog box. Settings, again, you, those animations are Windows Phone animations. The the uh, on-off switch is based on what looks like the Windows Phone on-off switch. The button is um, Windows Phone based buttons. These text boxes, notice that the, um, the blinking cursor doesn't fl fade, it just blinks on and off. Whereas Windows 10, it, bl it fades in and out. So you'll see that change inshallah when you update so we're gonna go personalization there's some add transparent to the touch start screen screen add torrents automatically search engine being could change it to AOL oh AOL interesting Google Yahoo Yandex Yandex oh I don't know that was an option but yeah color theme you could choose um, dark night <laughs> wow what are I didn't uh, th th I guess the reference wasn't that obvious was it okay so obvious reference guys okay system system theme so if my theme is if my windows phone theme is dark it'll be dark and it'll use my accent color and if my windows phone theme is uh, bright it'll use bright color so I, I for now I'll go back to the or, uh, superhero theme okay superhero dark knight I guess this person is a fan of Marvel and DC comics so I'm gonna quit this app and I'm going to go to the store sorry for the lag I don't know why this is there's a lag here I'm going to go to uh, Windows Store. I'm going to update this app, which will get me the Universal app. So I'm going to go to the hamburger menu, download and updates. And then I'll have so much apps ready for download. But uh, we're interested in the Torix torrent. Oh, there it is. It's downloading already. So here it's downloading. You can see right there. Ooh, look at my hand. That the the thing it the these yellow dots are my fingers. Ooh, look at all these fingers. Ooh, very nice, aren't they? There we go. There we go. All my fingers. Like, wait, let me add another one. There's my another finger. There's another. There's another. There's another. T ten of my fingers. Ooh, okay. The yellow dots are where my finger. This is my forefinger, middle finger, ring finger, little finger, thumb, index finger. Some of you call it. But yeah, it's downloading. 3.1 megabytes out of 3.6.1. Okay, it's okay. 9.1. It's it's the the OS is having a hard time determining the actual download size. So it's 12.50 out of 12.5 out of 12.5. I think it's finished downloading. It's installing. So now we should have the new Torrent app, our Torix app, and it says right there, Torix downloaded. Let's click that and let's. Oh, look, we have the new splash screen already. Again, this is a based on Windows 10 type of apps, which are splash, which have splash screens with uh, white screen pictures. What's new? Torrent app. Again, it's different. It kept the orange color scheme, so 
click back and again now you see it's a Windows 10 app you can't swipe back and forth you can I guess you can yeah, yeah you can swipe back and forth but again looks more professional looks like uh, some and 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 if you put it in continuum you could have a desktop version here I've m rotated it again see it's uh, because it's a Windows 10 app it resizes and if 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 my phone screen was bigger this uh, this thing wouldn't have to be hidden by default but for a medium sized phone screen you could see the items show up so again this scales well to desktops laptops and tablets and even Xbox so again I'm gonna switch back up oh there's an ad right there but you could see there's the filter here filter icon uh, also uh, yeah so the type of drone you're downloading you swipe back and forth and again the main navigation is done through the hamburger menu as is common with most mobile apps today and Windows 10 apps so you could buy this thing rate our app other applications about let's do about this is that about and let's see if we could change the color scheme again let's see how the dark theme looks with this personalization so again lo lo look at these buttons now these are uh, these and toggle buttons now are Windows 10 style here and uh, these arrow keys are also Windows 10 based so this looks like how er how drop down menus looked in Windows 8 and 10 and there's your theme so I have more themes now so we have Flash oh my god he's definitely a fan of uh, Marvel and DC Comics Flash that's awesome I love this so Flash Dark Knight we have Dark Knight we had the super we just checked super Nemo oh that's cute I, I I'm wondering if he's referring to Finding Nemo. Green Arrow, <laughs> wow! I, I I love that he loves he's he's using these superhero references. Um, Quicksilver, I I actually like it. Looks very nice. Twilight, or Torchlight, another superhero reference and System Theme. Yeah, the System Theme looks really nice here actually. And there's several backgrounds you could use. You could use this. You could use this use this I don't know I could use Bing to find something yeah oh you could use the Bing background okay interesting the Bing's daily images background so this is very interesting so I wonder what color we should pick let's try Dark Knight now oh this I, I I'm telling you guys this it's hard to pick so yeah I, I really really like these themes guys so Flash. I don't know. I might go with Nemo or Cover Quicksilver. Not bad either. I like that the, the image turns white as well. So should I go with the system theme or? I will say that I'll go with Nemo. I think that looks amazing. This, I like that it, the header becomes transparent. I really, really like that. So I like. I'll keep the Bing theme and I'll go here. Oh, beautiful home. I thought I clicked home. Home. There. So, I. I don't know why home doesn't work. So, add a torrent. That just brings up the file browser. Torrent from URL. You could see the uh, Windows 10 style dialog box. And again, if I go, sorry, go here again. Torrent from URL. You'll see that the blink is the blinking cursor now fades in and out. Typical for Windows 10 based apps. Let's press the back button. And it closes the app. But yeah, again, thank you guys for watching. I, we just updated a Windows Phone 8.1 app to a Windows 10 app. I hope you liked it.